So I am super excited to talk to Patrick Schweiss. Do you know that he is the most charismatic man in all of Sedona? And he runs the Sedona Film Festival, which is like the Sundance Film Festival here in Arizona. It's unbelievable, but he is so cool. So let's go inside Mary D. Fisher and see Patrick Schweiss and hear what's going on for this year's film festival. So what would Chris do at the end of February, beginning of March? I'd hang out with Patrick Schweiss and the Sedona Film Festival. Yes, awesome. So what are you expecting? We're expecting 12,000 people, nine days, 177 films. <sighs> Sedona's gonna turn into Hollywood. From the Red Rocks to the Red Carpet, Sedona Film Festival. It's gonna be great, great fun. And when does it start in the morning? How long, it goes all day it long, It goes right? all day long. So films at 10, 1, 4, and 7 every day. The 22nd through March 1st, it's going to be phenomenal. We've got a great opening night planned with Mariel Hemingway, David Ooh. Arquette, Francis Fisher, and Josh and Rebecca Tickell, the filmmakers of Heartland. We're seeing an audience test screening sneak preview of Heartland, oh and it's going to be absolutely phenomenal. We're kicking it off. The whole theme is Mardi Gras this year with oh. the colors and the festivity because the festival happens during Mardi Gras week, so we have special events planned on Fat Tuesday oh and God. all sorts of wonderful things. Great celebrity guest Rob Reiner oh is our gosh. festival honoree, so we're honoring him on February 29th and showing when Harry met Sally well when Harry met Sally I mean who doesn't know the line I'll have what she's having that's, right. that's exactly <laughs> everyone right. remembers that line that's gonna and be so fun it's and you are the awesome. host with the mostest I mean well, you thank do the you. best job ever thank you so much I have the best job ever I mean who wouldn't love to have this job to be able to have fun and hobnob with the filmmakers and the celebrity guests and get to show great films here in Sedona. So it's going to be a really awesome time. And I hear the after parties are pretty fun too. The after parties. Sedona actually has a nightlife during the film festival. You know how sometimes I, Sedona shuts down at, at 9, 9 o'clock? <laughs> yep. Our parties start at 9 o'clock. So mm -hmm. Sedona actually has a really cool vibe happening during the film festival. We've got the filmmakers coming in from New York and LA and all around the world and uh, that's when their night starts. So we turn a little bit of that into Sedona for the week. Now, are there tickets still available? Tickets okay. are available, okay. yes. Uh, they can go online at SedonaFilmFestival.org or visit one of our box office locations. And we have uh, six venues happening every time slot. So there's four at Harkins Theaters here in Sedona and our Mary D. Fisher Theater. And of course, the big house out at the Sedona Performing Arts Center, which is where all of our big celebrity events happen. Fantastic. Yeah, and and cool. tickets, if somebody just wanted to see one. If someone just wants to see one, it's just 15 bucks okay. uh, to go see a movie. And uh, if you're a member, it's a little cheaper, like, cheaper than that for us. For you. Um, some great, great other events happening too. Bella Gaia, it's a really beautiful multimedia show. Dancers and musicians from around the world. Incredible footage from NASA of our beautiful planet. Bella Gaia means beautiful Earth. Right. And it's a grand celebration uh, in just this immense multimedia celebration and dance extraordinaire on Friday night the 28th at the Sedona Performing Arts Center. It's absolutely unbelievable. So I hope that people will come out and see it. We have Ron Gannon, our real astronaut who's been in outer space oh and seen gosh. our beautiful planet from that perspective, is going to be here to host the show and give a little talk back. So that's going to be really exciting. And when is that? What and that's time? on Friday the 28th at the Performing Arts Center at 7.15. 7.15. And two nights before that, we have Mark Shaman. Mark Shaman is here doing an evening with Mark Shaman. You may not recognize his name, but you will recognize all of the work he's done. He does all the music composing for all of Rob Reiner's films, Billy Crystal's films. So he did the music for When Harry Met Sally, The American oh. President, which we're showing. But he also has a really incredible body of work from Broadway, from Charlie and the Chocolate Factory to Hairspray. He's oh done all God. the music for it. So he's bringing along a special guest, Megan Hilty, from the hit series Smash and uh, Wicked on Broadway. Oh and she's going to sing a couple songs. She's actually going to sing the song that was nominated for an Oscar last year that he performed with Bette Midler singing, Where the Lost Things Go, oh. from Mary Poppins Returns. Cool and we have the lead actor of Charlie, Willy Wonka and the Chocolate, uh, Charlie and the Chocolate Factory who played Willy Wonka. Noah Weisberg is going to be here to sing some of Mark's music from Charlie and the Chocolate Factory. It's really going to be an incredible live show going behind the scenes of composing for music, music for films and Broadway, plus getting some live performances. It's going to be a great night. It's going to be a great night. Yeah. And we so appreciate what you do here. Thank and you. you've got to check out the Sedona Film Festival. Yes.